this is Assistant Terminal Manager Jones. He has a few questions for you. By the train master bringing a company official into the office with him, he now has a witness to anything you say. Whatever you say at this point will be a statement which can be used against you. Although you are not required to give a formal statement at this time, you must give the officials a general idea of what happened. The personal injury report covers this, and you should not go beyond what that report requires. Be careful that you are not insubordinate by refusing to discuss what happened, but politely insist on being taken to the hospital emergency room. Your injury will more than likely require immediate medical attention, and that fact can be used against any claim of insubordination. Uh, the train master tells me you hurt yourself. Tell me how you did it. Well, there was real big ballast on the, on the walkway and some holes, and it was all uneven, like they'd been working out there or something, and they didn't level it off when they were finished. You mean to tell me you didn't see this before you fell, if you was watching where you were going? No, I couldn't. The, the yard lights don't shine back there when there's cars on both sides of the tracks, and, and besides, I was using my lamp to, to check the brakes to see if I had to knock off any handbrakes. Uh, man, my ankle's really killing me. Do you guys think you could get me to the hospital? Just a couple more moves to make before you tie up. I'd really appreciate your help here, huh? Here, the train master is trying to see if he can persuade you to not turn in an accident report. No matter how much you want to be a good guy, don't listen to him. Your train master may be more concerned with keeping his injury statistics down than with your well-being. In fact, railroads require injury reports to be completed shortly after an employee's injury you could compound your problems by agreeing to his appeal. If you don't recover from your injury and later need to make a claim, you could be disciplined, if not fired, for not timely completing an injury report. Can you help me out here? I'd really appreciate this. I'd like to, but man, it really hurts. I can't take more than a couple of steps. I really need to get to the hospital. Well, if you have to, but you report this as an injury, you know you break the safety cycle. The guys won't be able to get their safety jackets. Yeah. Uh, do you want everybody to blame you for that? I just want to see a doctor now. You know you got to fill out an accident report before you leave here. I, I can't. The, the pain is killing me. Just write down what I told you. I'll sign it later. Man, I really got to get to the hospital. If you guys don't take me, I'm going to call the ambulance myself. No, 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 we'll take you, but you know you have to fill out an accident report.